All right, so we have the same Tesla magnifier system set up, except now I put a tiny little radio meter here. Radio meter supposedly works by when sunlight hits it, hits the black side and creates heat. And that heat causes those veins to spin. It's also in a vacuum. Um, and so now I'm going to turn the system on. And, you know, there's absolutely no sunlight in here. We are in a, you know, room, ceiling. There's not really any sunlight coming in. So, there it is. Now we'll turn the system on. And it's spinning clockwise just as it would in the sun. And so I have this stick here with a, a grounded wire on it. And I'm going to stick it close and create a discharge ion path between the top load and the ground wire. And it goes way faster. Doesn't really seem to have a huge effect on the spin. And I think it's going really fast. So, you know, based on this, the Tesla top load could be creating a wave similar to the sun that's not based on, you know, infrared heat causing the veins to spin. Obviously, there's some other type of wave that's potentially coming off the top of this Tesla coil. Thanks for watching.